72 hours, goddamn, I'm feeling late. Damn, I'm in the face of my mind. Let's look at that cloud nine in this night. It's never on vacation. Sound of that mind's already in. Yo, what is going on guys? War Crooks here. Welcome back to the channel. Sorry I haven't uploaded for a couple weeks. So in today's video, I'm going to show you like a minute tutorial on how to change your gamepad settings in ESO, which is very, very much needed if you plan on using a controller on a PC for the simple fact that a lot of people like to dance inside your character model and it's extremely difficult to turn around and target them. And it gets you killed in a lot of situations. You waste a lot of extra resources. So instead of using some third-party app for PlayStation or Xbox, this is a much, much simpler way of doing it. it takes like a minute you don't have to be computer savvy it's like four clicks so without further ado let's get right into it so what you want to do uh, you want to hit your little uh, your little documents icon little file folder open that uh, now uh, go into your documents from documents select Elder Scrolls game now you do have to change this on live and PTS you have a live and PTS folder here so for now just select live now go down to user settings so uh, all this looks intimidating, don't worry about it. So you don't have to worry about any of this. So what you want to do to find specifically what you want, you want to find the gamepad sensitivity. So you'll hold down control, hit F. Now in this uh, square here, just type in gameplay, hit enter. Oh, excuse me, gamepad, my bad, I'm retarded. So type in gamepad, uh, not there, hit it again. Go down, right here's what we need. So this is your sensitivity essentially uh, for Elder Scrolls. Um, the three sensitivity I have it set at is max sensitivity uh, if you're used to playing Call of Duty um, certain games like that. I think this is preset to one. This will take a little bit of trial and error for you guys to figure out uh, what sensitivity you like. I would not suggest going higher than three because that is pretty much the max you ever want to go. It's kind of hard to target people above that. I play pretty much every FPS game on a max sensitivity so this is just right for me. and. As I've said, this will take a little bit of playing around with. So once you do that, uh, you can just close out. You have to hit save. Uh, actually, yeah, you hit file. You gotta go to save. Be sure you save the file. Exit out. Now, when you go into your game, uh, you do need to completely close out of Elder Scrolls, the Bootstrapper, Steam, everything. Once you reboot it, go into the game. That's when you will be able to see it in action. And then, like I said, there will be a little bit of trial and error process to uh, get your sensitivities just right. Don't forget to close out the game each and every time you adjust it and that's it so this has been horcrux it's good to be back guys um if you like the content consider giving the channel a like and a sub please 86 percent of you guys are not currently subscribed they'll help the channel out a lot it was great seeing you guys again can't wait to get back to uploading some content and you guys take care deuces